recommendation of the day. Vivian Old's traditional organic bacon. This is the unsmoked back version. I'd like smoked really, but unsmoked is fine. This stuff is thick cut. Mm. It's like having bacon steak in the mornings. It's amazing. Buy that. <laughs> <laughs> With the help of my brother via video emergency video conference call from the Caribbean, I have solved the pan holders problem temporarily with seizing wire. Here we go. Look. So I've just wrapped some seizing wire around the gimbals that I made. That's absolutely bang on. Look at that. Now I can relax. You know I enjoy cooking, but if you have to stand here holding the pans for 20 minutes, that's stressful, isn't it? Oh, I'll do a full review of this stove when we get back because I've used it and lived aboard with it with my daughter for two weeks by the time I get back or three weeks. Um, it uses quite a lot of fuel. I'm not sure whether that's because I keep forgetting to put the little covers on, these these little covers over the burners when I'm not using it, or whether they just use a lot of fuel. I don't know. By the time I get home, my test will be complete and I'll, um, I'll do a review. Anyway, bacon for breakfast. So unfortunately, in shot, lost all of my footage from the, uh, the first part of the trip down here. We're just picking our way down through the islands now. We've left uh, the moorings at Tresco, and we're going to St Mary's, because if we don't get fuel soon, um, it's going to be a very bad trip back. Uh, so, Tresco's right behind me. In fact, that's Tresco right there. And we're just picking our way down through here. done is plotted a route on Navionics that follows the ferry paths and I'm trying to follow them as exactly as I can. Because if anyone knows how to get through these rocks at any state of the tide it's the ferries. So we're just popping out into permanently deep water now where the initial um, the initial depth is like a metre, but with tide, you know, it's never going to dry there, is it? Well, it doesn't dry there, it's a metre. I think it's safe to say at this point that we've made it. It wasn't super tense. You can do it. You just need to plan. What we've got to do now is get fuel, and it's in the bag, frankly. That'll be a successful day, just that. Just get fuel. There's the antenna, the TV mast on St Mary's. There's Hugh Town. We're just going to hop over there now, come alongside the quay, hopefully, and get some fuel. So there's a, a white painted sign there. Fuel berth, right by the yellow bin. Fuel berth, it says there. That's where we're going. Sit down, darling, please. That's it. That's it. In case we pop on the side. Yeah, if you just sit here so I can reach the end of the control, that's it. Every year, actually. Who's the designer? Uh, Holman Applied. Oh, okay. 